What's going on everybody? This is Brian from SneakerFiles.com. I want to do something a little bit different today. Um, for those that do not know, well, you saw the title. So it's the Adidas Yeezy 350 Boost for infants, uh, both the Pirate Black and the Turtle Dove colorways. I do have a daughter, so I wanted to pick up one pair for her and then um, another pair for a friend for their child. But uh was actually came through, uh, got both pairs for retail, and uh, kind of do an unboxing. So, you guys know we don't feature Adidas that much, but I plan on doing it. It's just I don't know how close to the release, um, or after the release, I should say, I'll be able to do it. But uh, I might have to blur some of this out just because I don't want my address on it. So I'm not sure which one I'm opening first. But these things are super, super small. Like crazy. Okay, my information is down there. Look how small this is. A 7K. So this will be the pirate black colorway. This is crazy. I do not own any Yeezys. I'll be honest with you guys. So my daughter will have a pair before me. Oh wow, okay. <laughs> These things are cute, I'm not gonna lie. That might sound weird coming from a grown man, but I'm thinking about my daughter here, who isn't even two yet. These are crazy. I know there's a lot of like, um, I guess you can call them fake pairs, not really real, but if you guys are interested, hit the comments below, um, and I'll do a comparison for the adult pair, not like in depth or anything, but just a side by side, uh, Adidas Yeezy on the insole, UK, you know, I, I would even do a real versus fake comparison on these, but um, the only reason is I'm not sure if um, the little boost exposed. I'm not really sure if um, there is a market for that yet. All right, so the second box will be the Turtle Dove. And if you wanna see more of these type of videos of unboxing, let me know too. I try to do them time to time, but I really wanna showcase and talk about some of the upcoming releases and things like that. I'm shooting this. They just came today. It's Friday. Well, it's like 3 a.m. in the morning on a, I guess it'd be Saturday morning right now. And I just got to wake up to go pick up another pair of those breads. So, alrighty, alrighty. Turtle Dove. This is the pair I am keeping for my daughter. Same deal with the boxing and everything. Of course, different labels and things like that. She'll be stunting in a. Okay, okay. She'll be stunting in her little daycare she goes to, that's for sure. I just can't believe the resale value on these. Like, damn, some people want like five. I think it came down like 300, to be honest with you guys. These things are hella small. Insole real quick for you guys too. Well, not that one. It's actually well, almost the same. It's just you got your black detailing. I have a different setup going on right now for the unboxing because it it would be a little weird to unbox how I have it before. But um, onto that part of it. Uh, the real versus fake comparisons are going to start back up. I have a pair of, hopefully, I have a pair of the breads coming through, unless I get scammed. You never know with these type of peoples or people. But these are 
these are nice. Like, I feel weird saying cute on camera because I'm not that type. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> A guy to really show my emotions in that type of way publicly. But, uh, I mean, you can't help but to say, like, damn, if you like Yeezys and you just see these little things, it's like... You gotta, you know, admire them. They're, they're, you know, they are cool. They're cool. The lacing between the two looks a little bit bigger on the turtle dove. I wonder how these do hold up. But, uh, if you want to see a comparison, leave a comment below. And, uh, more, uh, Yeezy stuff, or not Yeezy, but Adidas stuff, Yeezy too. I'll also leave a comment. And, uh, I'll work that. I'm not just, I'm trying. I'm just not too sure how... Um, close to the release date. I mean, more than likely, it won't be before the release. It'll be after. But I guess at that point, I could do a real versus fake tutorial to help some of you guys out. But yeah, these are cool. I mean, if you guys got a kid or something, I don't know about spending $300 on some shoes, to be honest, but even $130, because that's what these retail, it's a little steep. But um, I thought, why not? So... Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to sneakerfiles.com. And if you haven't yet, make sure to subscribe.